In today's funny story, we bring you a hilarious tale of a tropical island where cannibals still roam. So, get ready for a roller coaster ride of laughs that will bring you to the punchline of the century. This island was well known for its tribe of cannibals and was very seldom visited by tourists, for obvious reasons. Now, even though this island had the occasional unsuspecting tourist making landfall, it would always turn out to be a one-way ticket, for the tourist, of course. The tourists, however, have been very scarce of late. As was their custom, they had an annual festival coming up where they revisited their cannibal heritage, and a subject for this feast had to be found to feed all the tribal chief's subjects. The tribal chief called a father and son to send them on a very important hunting expedition. I need you to go hunting in the forest for food for the tribe's annual festival. This is a very important mission, and I want you to get the best meat available. So, the father and son traveled deep into the forest, where they set up a hunting hide next to a small footpath, waiting for an unsuspected victim. A short while later, a skinny old man came walking down the footpath. The son, very enthusiastic, turns to the dad and said, Dad, let's get this one. I'm sure the whole tribe can all eat from this one. The father, not very impressed with what he sees, said to his son, My boy, that one will just not do. It has too little meat on it for the whole tribe. It's old and won't taste so nice, and the dogs won't even have enough bones as leftovers. So no, we are not going to eat that one. The old man was left alone to wonder on and a bit later a very chubby woman came walking down the footpath. The son, now much more eager than the first time, said to his dad, Dad, surely this one has enough meat to feed everyone. We can even have an after party with this one. It will also fry nicely if there are any leftovers. The father, again not very impressed with what he sees, said to his son, My boy, that one will also not do. For starters, it's very heavy to carry all the way back to the tribe. However, my main concern is that she might not have the healthiest meat. I would never forgive myself if some members of the tribe gets heart attacks from eating such fatty meat. I just think we should rather wait for something better. Now obviously, the son was getting irritated with his father's patience, but agrees to wait a bit longer. A short bit later, a beautiful healthy woman came walking down the footpath. Both the father and the son get a grin on their face. The son, now as eager as he have ever been, said to his dad. Dad, this one can have no problems. She's young, the meat must be very tasty, and we will be able to feed the whole tribe. There will even be enough leftovers for the dogs. The dad, grinning from ear to ear, said to his son. My boy, yes, we can take this one. However, we will not eat this one. The son, just very confused, asks his father. So, Dad, why will we take this one and then you say we cannot eat her? I just don't understand. The father, with an evil grin on his face, said to his son. My son, this one we will take home and then we will eat your mother. If you liked our joke, then please watch our next joke by clicking here.